have to excuse Seahawks head coach Pete Carroll for being so excited. After all, he's got a chance to win a Super Bowl today in nearly the same spot where, almost 20 years ago, his young coaching career came to an abrupt halt. Marino back, and he looks to the right side, throws, touchdown Ingram! It was a fake! Marino was faking! After the infamous fake spike, the Jets lost the rest of their games that season, and Carroll was fired only one year into the job. It was a mess, you know, we never really got started, and. A lot of things I'd have done differently if I had the opportunity to do it again, but I, I, there was no way. I was so young, I didn't know any better. In 1997, Carroll got another chance, this time with the Patriots. But replacing Bill Parcells proved to be difficult. Are you the whip? Yeah. Well, get your ass over there, row 44. And after missing the playoffs in 1999, Carroll was once again shown the door. And it really hit me that I needed to get my act together and start all over again. So I just started from scratch, you know, and, and from that point, all of the philosophy and all of the, the direction and all of the focus uh, totally shifted. It started with a change of scenery. For nine seasons at USC, Carroll mixed rigorous competition with an upbeat demeanor to great success, including two national championships. And when he re-entered the NFL world in 2010, Carroll was determined to take what worked in Southern California to Seattle. Jeez, you have any kids yet? We got two kids. Two, jeez. A lot of coaches are obsessed with controlling their players and getting them to behave a certain way on and off the field. You seem to have a real different philosophy. What's your view on that? I might be obsessed in a different way in that we really are trying to help our people be the best they can be. That's why you work together, that's why you work. Nice job, Grace. In doing so, we can create an environment where they, they can't wait to get here. They're doing it because they want to, not because they have to. We're not forcing them to do things. We don't have to coerce them. Let's go, here we go, here we go. Hop, 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 hop. Everybody's running. Ho! Oh! It's kind of like a college environment here. You know, guys uh, get to shoot hoops before team meetings, and there's music blasting, and, and everybody's real chill. It doesn't feel like a big business. Coach Carroll has made this attraction. You know, he's bought that kind of that L.A. spirit to, you know, the great Northwest here in Seattle. Ah! He's full of energy. That's why we're full of energy. He does a great job of leading and we just follow. Ball is tipped ah! over that door. Is it picked off? It is. It's picked off in the end zone. We're going to the Super Bowl. I tell you, it makes my, I'm emotional about it. How many times did you dream about this moment in the last 20 years? When, when you're in the league for as long as I was, you know, every year that's what you're thinking, you're aiming at, you're hoping for. We don't want to come here just to show up. We're going to come here and get this thing done. So it's a very unique experience and, and feel very blessed to be here.